What's going on guys? You got Quasi here for Quasi Animation Studio where you presently are and Quasi Media Network. So today we're going to talk about, again, because I have more than one video for this, this is particularly a series of sorts where we're going to do simple actions. You either using a reference sheet or a reference video, or you're going to do what they call rotomation, where you basically put the video in the scene, like for instance, behind her, and then you go step for step. Okay. All right, so in this case, what we're doing simply is animating the actions according to this uh, voice line, okay? So I already have it uh, synced to audio, follow on the playback, and then keen, we're gonna go whole character, okay? All right, so when I do that, I'm gonna set auto keying, select everything, hit I. So now it automatically does that, okay? So let's play the play play the audio back. I used the spell. She used the spell. Now this is from my versus series, the anime style of it, because of course I've changed it. Um, it's going to be moving from YouTube to streaming services, but it's the character models have changed everything. I'm no longer using these models for the series, but you can enjoy seasons one and two on YouTube on Quasi Media Network link is in the description <laughs> all right so all right uh and i'll have the links in the comment section all right so based on this we have a few frames here so let me let me spread this out a little bit okay so we already had frame zero let's see where this takes us just in front of the line so about frame 11. so let's say frame 12 no yeah frame 12 I'm going to start here. So on her middle section here, right? Right here. Um, I want her to be like, oh, I messed up. Okay. All right. So, yeah. I'm just make sure, oh, making sure I'm getting my gimbal selected correctly. All right. So here we'll have her sort of look in this direction. So roughly close to 16, scrubbing is not on. Turn it on, because I wanted to hit it. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I want her to be looking like she's sad about it. Okay, this is an FK also, so that means that some of this stuff is gonna move together, all right? All right, so do 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 did that one, did this one. Hit, um, on this one here, I think I'll move it forward. So we keep simple axis. Remember, we're moving from the midsection up to her head, okay? So you're gonna move from midsection up to her head. Okay, all right, excuse me. All right, so I want her to be looking down like she's chastising herself, okay? All right. I use so. I feel like I can do that at 23 frames. Let me select all of that. Let me move this out the way so now I can go back to the rotate gimbal and I'm gonna move all of this to 23. All right. There we go. All right. Just under, I'm doing this at 30 frames a second. So let me show you my frame count. 30 frames a second, okay? 24 is the usual, right? That most use, okay? So for me, I'm using 30, but I still work within a 24 frame scope. So those six extra frames gives me a little bit of tweak room, okay? That's my own personal workflow. All right, and I don't work in constant. I don't do the blocking like most people. I work in spline or in bezier, so. That's just where I work at. Because I want to see it break instantly. I don't want to do all that work and then, I, oh, it broke. And then I got to go into graph editor and do a hundred different things. I work in the graph editor to tweak the motion to make it look more clean. To make it look a lot. It, yeah, we'll clean it up. <laughs> all right, let me see. Like, for instance, it's here. Let's see. Uh oh. Go back. 
all right so the head motion i tend to give it like a couple of frames in front so I use the... I use... all right so this is a good um lesson for the graph editor okay so i know she's turning and her head going down so in the turn i know it's on the y rotation so what i'm going to do i want these handles to be free so i'm going to free these handles and here i'm going to push it back so i'm going to hit gz and i just want to see how that plays I use this. yeah I, use... I don't like that okay there we go i'm going to push it up a little Seemed like it chugged a little right there. Okay, so this one needs to be behind this one. So this will start and this one will start. So I'm gonna give it two frames. All right. And then one frame forward. And then on the rotation on the Y, again, freeing the frames, I mean, freeing the handles. And then sort of, okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. So these two, I think, need to be a little behind also. Hmm. Hold on. Okay. It's just one frame. All right. I use this. I use the head action here. So the down motion on the X rotation. Free. All right. I use the, the, I use. I, 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 I have an idea. Select all of this. See what happens if I do it like that. I use. That little bit of turn there. So on the Z rotation. Hmm. Free the handle. Hold on, let's push this a little bit. I use the yeah, yeah, a little weird for me. Okay, hold on, go on to the camera. I use the All right, we come out of pose mode and let's push the camera in some, turn it on. Because I think I need to pull it out a little bit. There we go. Okay. All right. So I'll turn that back off because I don't want it exactly on. All right. I, use the I, use I feel like it just needs to be smoother. And I know that most people will say, well, you can do that later or you can refine it more. I'm like, yes, but what's so wrong with wanting to get it done now? I use Oof. No, go back. All right, so I see what it is. All right, so here, she'll still sort of be going that way. So slowly move her in that direction and then her head somewhat, yeah. Catch the neck a little. But when I do that, I'm gonna grab these frames. Uh oh, wait, let's do this one at a time. All right, there we go. Give it two frames. And then this one, two frames. All right. But on the head, I'm still going to go forward one. All right. So I kind of wanted a little behind. I use the spell. All right. So when she makes this action here. All right. So the top one. Yep. Let me match it. All right. 45. Okay. Okay. Also want our shoulders to sort of deflate. So let's see. Twenty-five hold. Mm, Sixteen frames, and then I should be able to link that. 
yeah deflate i just linked them all right so another little thing too i like to do is uh use animate uh, overshoot smooth and i'll just click smooth and then on the other side i do the same thing okay all right hold on undo that just this all right oop, oop. not gonna do the whole thing right yep there we go all right i use the spell okay so i want that earlier than that so i do want this in the front of that let's do it again get in there so you can see the bones man all right so this action here i want down here do it at 26 and then she'll probably still take it a little further here yeah just a little not a lot um between here and there using all of your available tools okay i use the spell yeah it's not too bad i use the spell okay so this part where she says she used the spell use the spell i want her head to sort of slightly go back okay so all right so this frame i'm gonna delete let's lock all right all right hold on uh yeah Let's go to the playback. I use the spell. I use the spell. Okay, I don't like that. So when she does it, all right, it's too fast. Uh oh, all right. Use the spell right here. All right, that's cool, but I feel like the turn back is too fast. Uh oh, I didn't do anything right there. Yeah, okay, so hmm. Let's take it a little further out. Let's go to 75. Alright. I use the spell. Yeah, that's fine. Now this part is where I need to fix. I use the spell. Okay, so I want to smooth this out a little bit. Okay, this one on the Y rotation again. So we're going to be dealing with the Y. Free. Going to free these handles. Going to select them again. All right. Sticky go all right same thing on her head i just want these last ones gonna free them go all right just want to see let's see what happens i use the spell yeah there it is the uh, all right so what she says she used to spell that is a little too slow for me Yeah, there it is. I use the spell. I but I also kind of want like this secondary action. Hmm. Come on, thing, stop doing that when I click stuff. All right. 
where her head sort of drops here but i know this one isn't free so i'm going to do some by hand get in there tight okay almost like a linear action uh oh there we go all right All righty. Yep. I use the spell. I Is, use no. The spell. Okay. Here. Oh, it's also here that I need to play with. All right. On the X. Okay. Free, free, free. Hold on. Put this here so I can see which direction it's moving in. Is this steady just going? Let me see. All I right. Use the spell. Nope. That last frame, it's it's dead. Not even using that. All right. Okay, so here, there needs to be a slight action where it's almost slightly going back. I don't know most people are like, well, you could just use a graph editor for that. I'm like, why not just keyframe it? All right, let's see. Mm, it's on the Y. This should be free. Don't know, but about to find out. Put it here. Push it. Uh -oh. Grab this one. It has nowhere to go, but this one does. All right. I use the spell. I use the spell. Okay, so that on the way back motion. I mm, feel like it could be a little bit further out. I use the spell. There it is. I use the spell. I use okay, so I want to add a secondary action. So here on this arm, you can click this one, this, and her hand. Okay. Okay, so I want it to go up, so I'll do here. Mm, I might be wrong here, but we're about to find out. Okay. Oh. oh rotate. Oh. Rotate. No. Trackball. There we go. All right. Also means I have to fix this arm part. All right. Mm -hmm. Oof. All right. See how fast that moves. Oof. Okay, so let's let me fix that. I'm thinking delete this and pull this back. Hmm. Slowly draw this one back. And And click it all back into space. Click. Um, one, two, three. 
from that point, I guess I can do 23 frames and back to zero. Might not be what I want, but let's find out. I use the spell. I use the spell. Nope. I use. I want it to go. F uh. So this. Hmm. Yep. I use the spell. Nope. I use the spell. I use the spell. I use the spell. Okay, so that that's this motion right here. Don't like it. Let's go up to tween machine and I want this point two. Alright. I use the spell. Okay, here again, another twin. I use the spell. Hmm. I use the spell. No. I use the spell. It's just as word, just as bad. I use the spell. Hmm. I use the spell. I use the spell. I don't think I should have any of this. This goes away. It's trash. All right. <laughs> I use the spell. I use the spell. I do feel like her hand should come up a little though. Like this can go up along with her hand. So, for instance, let's go right here. So, this, mm, right? I could even go as far as to say do this one. Just a slight action. Let me grab the hand. Turn up where she's just moving her hand just ever so slightly. Let me listen, because I'm listening to it instead of looking right here. The spell. And then on its way back down. Right. Select all of it and turn off sticky and go back to smooth three. All right. I use the spell. Yeah. I use the spell. Even though we can't see it in the shot. So if we did change the shot, uh, the camera, I go to 80. Right, this way we get to see her a little bit, and boom. All right, so now let's go. I use the spell. I use the spell. I use the spell. Okay, so I want the animation to basically. I want this to basically end close to where her head stops. So again, sixty-five. All right. Okay, let's see. Go. Just simple actions like that change the entire scope. Okay, so now because we have this set like we do, let's do a quick uh, play blast. So I'll go in and set my settings and then let's go to the food deal. Or I don't think I have a render shot, uh, render folder in here. But about to have one now. And this one will be and then I guess I'll just call this Vista shot. All right, except hand F10. Excuse me. Again, it's just a play blast. So we're not doing a big old thing. No lighting. And this will probably conclude this just to see the playback. Of course, blinking, um, maybe even some secondary motion on the camera, you know, motion actions. I'm sorry, camera actions, man. 
I cannot word today. Excuse me. Okay. Yeah. I use the spell. I use so even here where her arm is clipping, I would change that too. Use the spell. I use the spell. I use the spell. Don't forget, like we make jerky motions or quick motions. So there's a slight follow through a lot of times, but understanding that dynamic. Okay. So um example. Well, no, not example. This is about adding the blink, right? So mm, this one. Okay. Um, five. Let's get in there. Get in there, I say. Man, I tell you, that drives me. Okay. Mm -hmm. And again, I'm using a control rig instead of just and a general and in general uh thing <laughs> i couldn't even say words bro all right copy paste we're gonna push this down go back in here do another play blast telling you i can't word today for some reason Now, even in this, you would have uh, secondary emotions like eyes or whatnot. I use the spell. I use the spell. I use the spell. Okay, so that part where she says she uses the spell is where I would probably change. Right here is where she would start blinking. So let's see it from playback. I use the spell. Yeah. I use the spell. I use the spell. So it gives that a little bit of a dynamic. All right. So I know you say, well, there's no lip sync or whatnot. I'm like, yeah, because we, we're not using it. Um, I'm just showing you default actions, getting accustomed to animating based on what you hear. Okay. So it's like those simple little motions, even there will be another one where I show you using like maybe an idol that you may have. You may have an idol that you made or one that you downloaded. Nothing wrong with using motion capture. Uh, if you, especially if you're going to be animating on top of it, doing layers right here in the NLA. So in the NLA editor, you could, you know, layer stuff. All right. So in the other video, we're showing you, I'm showing you, uh, the like, reference for the martial arts stances the dynamic poses and then crimson's doing those i'm having i'm animating crimson to do those poses but doing the in-betweens so it's not refined it's an older video i did it in june whatever the fifth month that's the six no so in may i did it in may and i never posted it i forgot so i'm posting it now or it's already up and then I'm doing this one. So this way you guys can see two different variations. And I know you might say, man, I would need it to be a little bit more comprehensive. I'm like, the issue with that is time. And the next issue with that is time. <laughs> uh, you really have to play with these things and get accustomed to doing it. I would go further than this. I would probably do like extra actions on top of this. Where, where she says, I use the spell. Like when she turns her head back, I would have her snatch her head back. I used to, I used to spell like she's like, I used to spell like she would literally jerk her head back like that. You know what I'm saying? I used to spell like she's really sad. Like the shoulders will go up like, okay, let's try that out. Right? So here, so I know that I have this, so I'll just grab these two and I'll mm, yum, 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 yum. copy paste. All right. So, huh? okay. And even then I would grab these and move them back a little. All right. Where she seems kind of defeated. Shoulders go up. Oh, this is go extreme, go extreme. And then 
well. <laughs> okay, so I know clearly that's not on time. So let's bring it back. I use the spell. Nope. Even even then, I think I could use this in the center. Ooh, that would be fire. I don't know. It's not extreme enough. Oof, hold on. Yeah, there it is. So I think let's look. I use the spell. 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 Yeah. So see, so little things like that would create that that sensation of her frustration and sadness for doing something though she knows that she knows is forbidden. But anyway, so I don't want to keep beating this up. Hope this helps someone. If it does, comment. Do not be afraid to comment and hit the like button. Share it if you will. Nothing but love.